Hey, it's Danielle McCulley here in Seattle, also known as DMAC, and today I wanted to talk about harmonics and how you can draw them using your MT4 platform. So right now I have TradingView pulled up on my screen. Um, this is a platform, it's free, and this is where I like to do my chart analysis and my chart markups. Now, I just recently started realizing that a lot of people do not use this platform. Some people don't even realize that it exists, I guess. But, you know, there's nothing wrong with that. That's fine. A lot of people like to do their markups on the MT4 platform. Sometimes I'll just use that too. You know, it just kind of saves time from jumping back and forth between, you know, TradingView and the MT4 platform, especially if you only have one you know computer or one monitor or screen whatever you want to call it so right now I have um, NU pulled up and this is a trade that I entered this morning but um, the good thing about trading view I think I mentioned it, mentioned this in another video you know they have all these really cool tools you know I wish MT, MT4 platform had you know this little harmonic two right here that actually plots out you know the point X to A B C and D and so a lot of the times when I trade harmonics I like to trade that um, C to the D leg and as you can see you know I have also used the Fibonacci to see where you know the retracements occurred and stuff like that and so this is going to be key to actually plotting the harmonics on the MT4 platform so right now this is easy because you just got this little tool where you can just click drag you know and form the harmonic and then I know like for most scanners what they do is um, they scan for the completed pattern so if you're using a scanner this signal probably wouldn't pop up until you know this pattern was actually complete but like I said I actually like trading the C to the D leg and then once that is completed you have that completed pattern you can turn around and you can sell you know just from the point D so it's kind of like a two for one special but anyway let's get over to the um, MT4 platform so I can just show you how that looks on the MT4 all right so this is um, it may look a little confusing but you know you have to actually manually draw these and I know some some people have a hard time spotting harmonics um, but to me harmonics is just you know double double bottoms and double tops so if you're good at spotting you know those things the M's or the W's whatever you want to call it then you probably can train your eyes pretty quickly um, pretty quick to be able to spot these harmonic patterns now this is just a possible setup um, this may not even play out but um, it looks like it could be a potential pattern form in here so how do you plot the harmonic patterns on the MT4 platform so I'm just going to start with this um, let's see let's just start with a uh, we'll erase that okay so, and it, like I said, as you see, I'm in this, um, I'm currently in this trade up 10 pips. So we'll see how it plays out. So first, what I like to do is you have to figure out, you know, where this, um, where this retracement occurred at what fib level. So you want to, you want to grab your Fibonacci tool and you want to, go from the swing high to the swing low um, we're going to make this one yellow we just do it just like I had it so you want to do the swing high to the swing low and as you can see this um, did a nice pullback to or we'll say it's close enough to the um, the 78.6 all right so then the next step would be to use your um, Fibonacci tool again to see where this leg here pull back. 
so then what you do so you did, did the first one you went from the swing high to the swing low then you'll grab the Fibonacci tool again and you'll go from this swing low um, you're just following the the movement of the market really to this swing high here and then we're gonna make that a different color so you can see it so we'll do that one back to the um, aquamarine okay and so so you're just really following the you know the pattern the flow of the market so it's from swing high to swing low it pulled back we already set this at the yellow it's the 78.6 that's close enough and then you want to go from this swing low to this new high right here and this is going to be the the aqua color and as you can see this came this retraced back to the 78.6 so once you determine these levels you know so this will be like x to a a to b b to c so this is your c your c point right here which is at 78.6 and then your b is also at 78.6 so it could be a possible um, butterfly pattern that's forming but like I said, this is just a possible setup. Now it could play out. It may not play out, but um, we will see. So now once you've determined, you know, those levels, those Fibonacci levels, um, pretty much all you have to do is you take um, this little shapes, the triangle shape tool, and you just connect the dots pretty much all you do is so you got the one half right there and then let's see you will grab the same tool again Fibonacci okay the triangle and you would connect the dots here and then you're probably wondering how do I know where to connect it up here right so this is when you would have to know the different patterns and um, you know how far they can extend so that information is needed in order to know how far the D leg can extend which will initially be your take profit right so this is at the the point B is at the 78.6 the point C is at the 78.6 so this could be a potential um, what pattern is that it could be a potential butterfly so if it is going to be a butterfly then that D leg I mean it can extend to this point here uh, the 1.272 or the 1.618 and that's pretty much it that's how you plot harmonics um, and a lot of people I know a lot of people like harmonics but may not fully understand them and they're just advanced Fibonacci so in order to understand these patterns you have to understand the Fibonacci levels as well but we will um, see how this plays out I did enter this this morning um, actually my entry was a little bit late but um, I answered because you know I saw the double bottom and then also I got this nice rejection at the 800 MA so I don't know I, I, a lot of people you know are <laughs> talking about my MA's and stuff like that I don't care you guys I'm not knocking anything that you do out there or what you're using I could say do what works for you I like using the MAs for entries sometimes you can get like some clean entries off the um, those wicks to the moving averages especially this 800 it acts as um, really strong support and resistance it's one of my favorite MAs and that's why I've added it to the chart so um, yeah and I have a couple more here you know and and 
they work for me so I don't care if it looks like spaghetti or whatever you know you want to call it it's not your chart and you don't have to use it okay so I'm going to use what I like and <laughs> I don't see why people are making a big deal out of it but obviously they are but anyway um, yeah moving right along so this is how you that's how you plot harmonics and harmonics and Fibonacci they are very powerful um, this is on that four hour time frame so if you can find a harmonic on the higher time frames um, they're usually pretty solid they're pretty good and then if you come down here you'll see Maxwell equation um, it's, it's showing that it is going to push up now it does start curving a little bit but that's later on so we'll see um, I actually have my TP set here but we'll see how uh, that plays out I don't know why I selected that so I might adjust that I don't know we'll see all right and so for those of you that you know um, if you like harmonics but you are new to trading and you really don't know um, anything about harmonics um, there is a nice little scanner too so let me jump over here on the, um, let's see the scanner the scanner here I think it's gonna be this one okay there you go so um, there's a nice very very nice harmonic scanner that you can purchase um, this is the FSO harmonic scanner and um, this is on a little test account that I like to call it I don't know it's on a different account this is on my VPS but as you can see um, this pattern just formed so you know this will give you the age it tells you how many candles so you, you can see uh, one two three is on the fourth one and it gives you the time frame it gives you the bullish crab and not only that it gives you everything that you need to know so this is a perfect system for newbies and advanced um, traders as well but if you're new I know a lot of new traders aren't sure where to you know take their profits or set their stop loss and things like that so this is a very nice system um, if you're looking for something that's going to assist you with those things so let's see you know I also entered this on my other account but I've been having problems with this VPS just kind of being slow a little bit so so TP1 I'm I said it a little bit early so if you TP1 is about 53 pips so that that's pretty good and you get this nice little future prediction indicator down here Maxwell equation and look at that it's just beautiful that's the type of um, things I like to see on the Maxwell when it just shoots straight up like that those are the type of signals that I'm looking to trade and it does tell you the pattern so it doesn't really give you the distance and the levels between point A B C and D but it does tell you which pattern um, was formed and completed so right now you're looking at a bullish crab the crab is my favorite um, so anytime I get a crab signal or alert you know it just it grabs my attention for sure so I like trading those a lot and they are one of the more accurate patterns another thing about the harmonics they will extend sometimes but I think the crab is like 90% accurate so um, I yeah I just like them I've, I've had good results with um, trading the crab patterns and stuff like that so you know this is a nice little handy tool for those of you that are new or for those of you that you know you've been trading a while and you want to kind of add harmonics to your um, you know to to your to your skill set then definitely check out the FSO harmonic scanner um, you will not be disappointed I promise you that alright so if you do want to um, grab this system um, I will leave the link below the video if you have questions about it then um, I also have my Facebook link below the video just hit me up on Facebook and let me know um, 
if you have any questions but yeah that that's pretty much all i wanted to show you so um there's quite a few you know you can manually do the the harmonic um patterns or you can manually do them on the mt4 platform where you can just have everything here um or you know if you don't want to draw your own um if you don't want to draw them manually yourself you can just uh you know we have this handy little tool right here the fso harmonic scanner 6 really very nice um very nice tool i just had someone purchase it um a few days ago and they they they're very uh been very happy with it so yeah if you if you want to grab that go ahead you know just click the link below the video um it'll give you some more information about it and if you have any questions feel free to contact me on facebook um i do have a chat group so if you'd like to be a part of that hit me up on facebook and just let me know all right that's it so um yeah i will see you guys in the next video let's see hopefully um yeah i'll wait and see how this trade plays out you know all right hope you guys are having a good trading week and i will talk to you guys later